Time Burns. What's going on? It's your girl Amanda. You already know. I am headed to work this morning. Heading into the office, baby. Uh, so, yeah, I'm working in the office today. And um, I'm trying to feel better, y'all. Because, like, now I'm congested. And um, I don't like the way that feels. Like, I don't. So, I'm telling you, Florida be trying to take me out. Because I ain't never, ever, ever, ever had this many allergy problems until I moved to Florida. Yeah. Okay. So, seriously? You don't know where you're going? You don't know which way you're going? Um, so, anyway, how y'all doing? Okay. How you doing? Uh, good morning. I don't know if I said that or not. Well, it's morning to me. It's 8 or 6 a.m. So, I don't know what time y'all are watching this. Okay. But this is going to be a day in the life of your girl. You know, a work day in the life because that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to get some footage for you guys. Obviously, if I did, you watching this video. So, yes, how was everyone's um, holiday weekend? Did you get your, you know, your extra day off, girl? Did you get your extra day off? Okay, I hope so. Um, I have been busy the entire weekend all the way up to yesterday which was Tuesday so you know even though I wasn't physically uh, even though I wasn't at my job they were paying me okay I was definitely working okay uh, so we finalized the move to Florida and everything um, got the storage uh, cleared out in Louisiana Day I had a birthday party um, that same weekend. Our anniversary was Sunday. My daddy had his party Saturday. Our anniversary was Sunday. And uh, we moved all of our stuff out of the Louisiana storage, the rest of our stuff, on Sunday. We got back home, on, we got back to Florida on Monday. And uh, yeah, so, and then yesterday, which was Tuesday, I just lay it around because I felt so bad, like, for real, for real. This drainage, it ain't doing it for you, girl. So, yeah, that was my weekend, you know what I'm saying, still working. Then yesterday, uh, later, once I started to feel better, we ended up having to unload the, um, you know, the U-Haul, obviously. So, yeah, we have officially finalized the move to Florida. And, uh... You know, it is what it is. But I do miss my mom and I miss the Louisiana food. So I definitely had to go back and give me some boudin, some cracklings, with well, the chicken cracklings, and some uh, Richard sausages because that's the only one I eat. And um, the and my coffee, which is the community coffee, the Mardi Gras, the Mardi Gras flavor. They only have that there. Uh, so they have community coffee here, but it's not that particular flavor. That flavor is usually limited edition to when Mardi Gras time, but they made it like throughout the year now. So, but it's, that's the only way I can find in Louisiana. Okay. So that's my life in this year. <laughs> well, we can get it anyway. Two, and I was going to put on two plugs and have one star skin on. <laughs>
Christmas at home buns. Ooh, it's hot in this pier. Okay, turn the AC on. Turn the defrost off. Turn the air down. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. And let's get it out, okay? Hey guys, I had to come into Aldi real quick. I need some more mimosa since we're gonna be by the pool. But um, Heather wants me to get some potatoes while I'm in here. I already grabbed some honey, and I am um, always come in here on the aisle where they have like home stuff because you always find some good stuff. So let's see what they got. I know why I don't go in Aldi, Aldi, whatever you call it. I know why I don't go in there a lot, child, because I ain't got time for that bag situation, okay? And have y'all ever been riding and you've been so, like, out of it that you ain't realize you need a gas, girl? I'm tripping. The truck is like, ding, ding. I'm like, what is going on? A low fuel, what? I'm like, girl, I gotta get some gas before I be walking. And I hate pumping gas. I really do hate pumping gas. But technically it ain't my fault because I didn't switch cars today. But um, oh Lord, I sure hope it let me make where I'm trying to go. Girl, I got to find me a gas station, honey. Got to find me a gas station. Let me turn off this auto thing too, cause that's around be at a red light and I'm gonna shut off and then trying to start back up. Where is the closest gas station? I don't even know if I'm singing that right, child. But anyway, y'all, so I just came up out of Aldi. I went in there for my mango mimosa. However, they only had the one with the orange juice in this particular Aldi. So I wonder if I would've went to the next Aldi would they have made a difference. No, I don't need a red light. I need to get to the gas station. Um, so I don't, oh, look all that traffic down the line. I'm not going down now. So anyway, what I was thinking was, okay, first of all, I'm aggravated because I need to get gas and I don't want to pump gas. But what what the hell was I talking about? I forgot just that quick. 
I need to get my vlog camera out of storage too now that we actually have it in Florida. I forgot what I was talking about. Oh yeah. So um the other one we went to is the one who had the uh pineapple, I mean the mango mimosa. But this one only had the orange one. And if I go to the other one, I'm gonna get caught up in traffic because that's where the traffic starts past our house. Um so I definitely don't want to do that. I think I still have something left in the refrigerator. Hopefully this orange one is good. I don't know, I don't know. But y'all, those candles smell so good. And I'm gonna I'm do like a, uh, I'm gonna definitely kind of go through a more thorough um, thing with you guys uh, on the candles. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Like before I even open the box. But I did end up, I ended up getting the, um, the, the uh, pink box because it doesn't smell like food. Like I don't like the candles that smell like a strong, like food, like caramel. Cause I don't eat caramel unless it's salty. So I don't like those. So I didn't get the, you know, the food smelling ones and stuff. So I did get those. I usually only buy three week candles, but these, like when I say they already smelling, I can't even have to light them, but they're so beautiful. Look at that. Oh, this one is bergamot and rose. Two of my favorite candle type, candle scents. Like I like scents. With, uh, I like candles with rose on them and bergamot. So it just works that they're together. What is going on with this? That's first of all, nobody, that's not even, that building's not even open. Why is the fire department right there? I hope everybody okay. Anyway, oh, I still got the Sam's car in my purse. So hopefully I can make it to Sam's to get some gas and stay a little bit cheaper. A little cheaper. Y'all, excuse me, twirling my hair. Whenever I'm thinking like really hard, I'm in deep thought, I twirl my hair. It drives my husband crazy. But when I'm in deep thought like that, I, it, listen, I twirl my hair. So, uh, yeah. That's what I'm doing. Trying to get some gas. You know what I'm saying? So, okay, so we got the green light. Let me go ahead and get over. Thank you, buddy. Said with me, buddy. Holy moly, donut shop. Holy moly, I need to get some gas. Okay. I thought it was like a little cap right here. A little cap cap. Oh, it's not. I seriously gotta wait on this light, bread. And they got a line. What side of the gas tank on? On that side. Okay. So real quick secret y'all, if you do not remember what side your gas tank is on, let me help you out with it. <laughs> this is my little hack right here, okay? Look at your look at your meter that shows you, you know, your gas amount or whatever. In the middle where it has your little where it has a little gas tank symbol symbols, emblem symbol, all that put together symbol, um, there's an arrow. The arrow is pointing towards the side of your car. Where the tank is so if you don't know that now you know you're welcome thank me later or now either one is fine but anyway so yeah that will help you so you know because listen i've seen so many people be pulling around and around because they can't remember what side their um thingamajig is on y'all know what i'm talking about but anyway y'all let me get off here because i need to go here and get some gas like dead ass oh that right <laughs>
I'm not even your type But you got my attention You're something that I like Let's get out this club Good morning, honey buns. When I say I ain't got a nickel bag, a lotion on my feet trying to run out this door, I know that's not. First of all, I don't do it as your feet. Just tell me how. I don't like to see it as your feet. And I sure don't like to feel no as your feet. And yes, I was trying to walk out the door. Well, I came over here because I put my shoes on by the door. So anyway. Get that done. I think I grabbed my lunch already. I'm whispering because it's gonna be asleep. And uh, I ain't trying to wake her butt up. Now look at all her supplies that came in yesterday. Oh, uh, supplies for the, the G2 bin. Everything, chill. Okay, yeah, but I'm gonna hash your feet. Keep it in your purse, girl. Keep it in your purse. All right, y'all, come on. Let's go. Hey, y'all. So, your girl is about to get in the tub. I just, we just came from eating. Uh, we went to a hibachi spot. And we just came from eating. I didn't get a chance to like vlog in there, but I'll put over here, you know, what we had to eat and everything. And yeah, so anyway, I am about to put my hair up in a bun or in a bonnet or something. Hop my butt in this tub. Well, I'm gonna hop in the shower first. Then I'm hopping this a bubble bath over here. So yeah, um, I'll probably be doing some more editing tonight. I do have like I have I have lots of footage I pulled off of my phone. So I'm pretty sure I'll be doing some more editing tonight. Um, so if you guys see a bunch of, you know, vlog videos, y'all know what happened, okay? All right, y'all. So I took my bath, watched a movie with hubby downstairs, the, um, called Wrath of a Man. Pretty good movie. I didn't get a chance to see it at the movie theater, so it was good. And then I started watching Spiral again. But since I had already watched it at the movies, it really wasn't that interesting. Um, I hope it couldn't handle the gruesomeness. So, yeah. But, uh, so, uh, he down there watching basketball. Watching those Lakers. But, um, I went on and came upstairs and got in the bed. So I can watch me a movie because I don't want to watch or hear him cussing about the Lakers since they're not about to be in the playoffs. So, well, in the finals. So anyway, y'all, I just wanted to come in and end the vlog. And um, I will see y'all later. All right.